Rami Ashur and Karim Darwish to battle it out for one of the sport's highest honours. It's quite simply the biggest game of their lives and it's coming up right now, the World Championship Final. He's not winning things. Rami's different, he's won lots. He's won a lot from a very young age. That's a different style of squash, Darwish, a more traditional. Yeah, you'll see here Darwish playing straight. Wow, God, that's fantastic, <laughs> straight drop. That was tight. Well, like I said before, you'll see the angles from Remy and you'll see straight from Kareem, but that was just phenomenal. Aronia Shaw in the red shirt. Slightly nervous start. He's been in enough big occasions. He'll take this one in his stride and in goes the backhand drop. Well, we see the pattern there. He takes a cross court in. Two, three. Opens an opportunity up and from all over the court. And club players put the ball too close to each other. And I thought Darwish actually contained his follow through very well. Yeah, I think there was absolutely nothing wrong with that. And the ball was in the middle of the court and needs to be penalised. Oh, no. beautiful. That's a little bit Rami like. Great touch. Using the angle there, created. 5-2. From here, from Rami. Using the angle then off the boast. Came across the angle. Took it into the, I think it's the type of decision a referee gives early on. That he gives too many of them. He has a little warning with the player. He tells him to play the next one. <laughs> this time no it's Darwish's turn to Hand out. And Darwish gets a no let. 3-6. He was no, heading he towards the, the front wall, and then Chris suddenly turned right, round no and tried to get towards you. the back wall. Three, six. And found Rami Ashour in his way. Ashour, that boast, the ball hitting the side wall, and then clipping the top of the tin, gifting a point to Darwish. The other thing you get out on a lot of times is when a number seven Sent seed... the wrong way. A beautiful shot. Number seven seed reaches the final. Sometimes that is their final. They're just happy to Nine, be there. Four. And it's a fantastic achievement in itself. Rami, I just can't see him being happy. Hisham will have a few words to Rami after this, I think. Rami's good brother. A stroke to Darwish. Darwish End gets Darwish. a penalty Go stroke to, to take the opening down. game here in the World Open Final. I don't know whether that con will continue or whether Rami will obviously apply more pressure, we think that that question will have to be answered. It would be so easy for him to go on and pretty much capitulate, and he hasn't done that. That's tight stuff, you could see right down the line. No players that's scraping the ball off the side wall. Rami Ashok picking up. A very tight drop at the front. Oh. Sticks up a high lob, and it... Flips okay, the thank you. The ball, ball was out. That's out. Hand out. <laughs> Bit of semaphore there. Hand out, three off. Well, you might. Well, <laughs> I, 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 I did actually think that, but I thought I might say different. <laughs> but yes, you expect great things in a World Open final. And it's the mistakes that surprise you for a match of this importance. Well, yes and no, really, because of, because the match is so big, it's difficult for the quality to be outstanding. I do think Kareem is playing some excellent squash, certainly for his level as well, because he clearly is just a little bit behind Rami in terms of ranking results, titles. Well, there we saw a beautiful touch from Rami Ashur. Hand out. It's a good length, isn't Hand it? Hand out, 7-6. Nice hold again and a beautiful length second time round and then variety. The length battle starts up. Good volley in early from Rami on the back end side, nice and straight. Good structure from both players at the moment. A big rally. And there's a talent. Just can't resist it sometimes. And again, beautiful angle on the forehand and Darwish squeezes it. Ball out. And there's passion. He knows this is a big phase. Well, let's see that again. Is that slice cross-court volley. Well, the first seven. one was a nick. 
And the second one was just the angle. Look at and that. And it goes. And then that squeezed the error. Shaw sure gets the let. And that's another good lesson for juniors. If you want to get a let from the referee, you better show that you can actually hit the ball. Down. That's in the 10 Down. from Kareem Darwish. So Rami Ashaw has fought back. It's one game all. Darwish is now under pressure as Ashur took game three 11-4 and seems to be on a roll. We join the fourth game at 4-all. Rami Ashur turned the tide in that third game, powering through 11-4. Let's see what Darwish can do, Chris. Well, yeah, obviously a little bit of dip in form from Kareem. Pick up and stand up from, from Rami. Got himself in this fourth game, and it's all now just about battling. Not just on the scoreboard in that second game, but in the actual game itself, he was not dominating. But once you give this guy a sniff, it really is. Look that stretch a from viper. the teeth to the left wall. He makes oh, it right. so easy. The ball, the ball was down. <laughs> uh, just a second. Ball's down. Thank you. So Rami Ashur screaming and hollering, telling the referee that Kareem Darwish's ball was just down. Just there, you can see it rise up. Rami, 21-year-old from Cairo, twice a world junior champion, and now just a few points away from being a world open senior champion. So the defensive game there of Kareem is not of the same caliber as. Rami's Allen. Earlier on in the game, he was getting Rami up into the corners. He was controlling it. Now, when he's going in the corners, he can't lift the same way. He can't defend it the same way. Great Nine touch four. at the front there. Rami Ashur. Exquisite touch. Great reach. So to Darwish. To Darwish. And out. Five nine. So let's see if Darwish is able to make one final push. Yeah. 60 minutes on the clock. And Rami Ashur serving for the World Open Championship. And there it is. He buries that loose ball in the front right mid. He hugs his Egyptian teammate. His good friend Kareem Darwish. And they're a private moment. Middle of the court, surrounded by more than 2,000 fans here in Manchester. Rami Ashour is the world champion. A big hug from his big brother Hisham. So the title goes to Rami Ashour. Well, uh, Laura, I've never felt better. Uh, it just it feels great, you know. As I was thinking about um, this word throughout the whole match and before the match, and uh, and I was just trying to keep my focus all the time. And uh, I mean, it wasn't easy, but um, um, I mean, Karim pushed me really hard. I mean, the first one, I was maybe I was a bit sleepy, and he was yeah, everything was smooth with him. Everything went to the right spot with him, and he played played perfect in the first one. I had to fight really hard the second one because I knew if I got the second one, it could have been much much more harder than this. So um, I was insisting on taking the second, and it happened, and then. Um, and then I just uh, kept the focus and um, I kept the long, the long rallies and um, I'm happy with the way I played. I'm really delighted that everything happened this tournament, the, the organizing, the, the people, the volunteers. Uh, I mean, I've really enjoyed playing this week in England and hopefully I'll be back again.